it, you know, it's very impressive how well it works. One of the things that happens with trauma is that we shut down, we dissociate, we are scared of being with the pain inside, and that's what gives rise to all of the addictions. So ayahuasca tends to kind of let people come deeper into that quite quickly. It's one of the ways it can work is, is, is that it simply removes your defenses largely against the repressed material. People can have powerful images, not just images, but actually emotional reverberations of the child's trauma along with an awareness that they're observing this as an adult. Now, some people completely get immersed in their trauma state during the ayahuasca ceremony without any awareness that this is just me as an adult observing this compassionately. That's why you have to do it in a supportive, safe context. It's not a drug experience. It's not about you take this and you'll be okay. It's really an interactive, shamanic event where the shaman works with you during the night to help you through these difficult spots. So it's not simply the chemical effect, it's actually um, a human process where the context, so the chanting, is very specific to help you through these difficult states and to support you. And sometimes that depends on and work energetically with you as well. But it's designed so that whatever you go through, you're going through it in a supportive, safe context, which is, of course, what didn't happen in the first place. Right, exactly. So whatever traumatic event occurred to you, when you endured it as a child, there was no support. There was no sense of somebody helping you. This is why you were traumatized. Going through it with that kind of support can be very healing for people. And, of course, it helps them understand themselves. They also didn't realize what has been driving them all their lives, what they've been running away from, and what they've been trying to hide from, what they've been carrying inside without fully realizing it. So that's one aspect of the ayahuasca experience. It's not the only aspect. There's another one that's just as important. But in terms of trauma, it does highlight and have you see the trauma. You no longer think you're crazy. You actually get what happened to you. Go to killabeecenter.com, Radical Recovery Summit, for access to the interviews, you can watch them free online, or you could purchase an all-access pass. KillabyCenter.com